The Murray River, normally known for its beauty and tranquility, is not always the case. One weekend of the year, it's interrupted by massive V8s and twin turbos rumbling through the hills. This is the Southern 80, Australia's best ski. All right, so we're down here at the Southern 80. So this is where we get big block boats with superchargers or turbos and strap skiers behind them and race at over 100 miles an hour. So if you look behind me right now, two skiers are taking off behind a blown big block boat. That's nuts. So we're down here at the starting line to check these guys out taking off. If you can even hear me over these V8s, we're gonna try and get some interviews done and see what this is all about. See how these guys go from I don't even know, how do you even get to skiing at 100 miles an hour? This is the craziest sport I've ever seen and we're going to take you all the way through it and see what it's all about. Alright, so we've managed to snag an interview with the owner and driver of the Superman speedboat behind us right here and we're going to learn a little bit more about it right now because I don't know a single thing. So, pleasure to meet you. Yeah, okay, good to see you again, Pez. mate. Hey Pez, I'm Darren. So, Darren, the owner and operator of the boat, we're going to learn a little bit more about it. It doesn't look quite like a wake boat, like I'm used to. No, it's uh, it's only made to go fast, not tow skiers with a wakeboard on, unfortunately. So it only goes fast, and it looks like you've got a big V8 and a couple of turbos back there. Yeah, it's a, it's a big block chev with every single thing you can do to make it go faster. Every single thing. You guys heard it at home. Every single thing. How much horsepower is it actually making? Uh, about 2,200 horsepower at the moment. <whistles> yeah. I bet, I bet that goes pretty fast. Yeah, it'll do probably 260 kilometers an hour pretty easy too fast for me tell you what so you've got some skiers on the back of this thing how do you know if they're falling off or what's going on we've got an observer sitting backwards that so someone's them. facing the wrong way going that fast keeping a good eye on them that's even more nuts <laughs> you guys are crazy how do you start doing this do you start with an outboard and work your way to a big block or uh, yeah most people do but yeah that's how you do it you gotta learn how to drive so yeah, these guys sit on just under 200 kilometers an hour most of the time, so you've got to know what you're doing. That's crazy. How many of these Southern 80s have you actually done? Jeez, I would say 20. 20. Wow, well, hopefully we can actually get some footage of the Superman this weekend, and uh, I, I wish you all the best. Good luck, guys. Um, hopefully we see the Superman on top. Hopefully. We're trying to work it out now. Hopefully we're one away, but we're not sure.
So we're back here after our interview with Superman yesterday. We decided to go back, regroup, and we actually forgot to get any more B-roll. So today we're here at the start of the Southern 80. We haven't really described what that actually is. So it's 80 kilometers flat out down the river. This is the congregation area where they all sort of start and just wait here in the water, ready for their name to be called out. Then they'll head up to the start line and kick off. So we'll be sure to get you guys heaps of footage of all of that today. We'll head down to the next spot. We'll get some more footage of these boats flat out and we'll explain more what they're doing along the way. All right, so we've just got word through that they're actually gonna postpone the event for the year. Um, something out there's happened, not sure what, but they've red flagged it for the day. So we don't have any footage to show you. We had everything organized. Um, we we're gonna put a GoPro on a boat. We had like three stops down there to get you extra footage. However, if there's no race, we can't film anything. So I just wanna have a sp very special thank you to the Superman team. So Daniel and Darren, they were super helpful. I had a heap of information. You can see in the B-roll here that I've got for you or posted earlier that I've learned so much about these boats over the last day and they're so awesome. And I just wanna bring the information home to you guys about how 2200 horsepower in a one ton boat with two scares out the back is pretty much the most awesome thing you can do on the water. So a very special thank you to them. Tell your mum to subscribe. I know she's been watching and we'll catch you at a future episode where hopefully you get to see some cool boats on the water.